That village has to be around here somewhere. Oh, there it is. Now to find Piano Boys. Oh, I like Perk Boys. Hi, Piano Boys. I just watched How the Grinch Stole Christmas. What a great movie. Yeah, I saw it too. Hey, I've got an idea. Could we do a Minecraft version? Let's do it. I'll let you do the honors. Okay. We well, see it began long time ago. Every who down in Whoville liked Christmas a lot, but the Grinch, who lived just north of Whoville, did not. The Grinch hated Christmas the whole Christmas season. Oh, please don't ask why, no one quite knows the reason. It could be perhaps that his shoes were too tight. It could be his head wasn't screwed on just right. But I think that the most likely reason of all may have been that his heart was two sizes too small. But whatever the reason his heart or his shoes, he stood there on Christmas Eve hating the Who's. Staring down from his cave with a sour, gritchy frown at the warm, lighted windows below in their town. For he knew every Who down in Whoville beneath was busy now, hanging a holly who wreath. And they're hanging their stockings, he snarled with a sneer. Tomorrow is Christmas. It's practically here. Then he growled with his Grinch fingers, nervously drumming. I must find some way to keep Christmas from coming. I'll make a quick Santa Claus hat to the coat. And he chuckled and clucked. What a great Grinchy trick. With this coat and this hat, I look just like Saint Nick. were dark. No one knew he was there. All the Who's were all dreaming sweet dreams without care. When he came to the first little house on the square. You're a mean one, Mr. Grinch. You really are a heel. You're as cuddly as a cactus, you're as charming as an eel, Mr. Grinch. You're a bad banana with a greasy black peel. You're a monster, Mr. Grinch. Your heart's an empty hole. Your brain is full of spiders, you've got garlic in your soul, Mr. Grinch. I wouldn't touch you with a 39 and a half foot pole. You're a vile one, Mr. Grinch. You have termites in your smile. You have all the tender sweetness of a seasick crocodile, Mr. Grinch. Given the choice between the two of you, I'd take the, um, seasick crocodile. You're a rotter, Mr. Grinch. 
You're the king of sinful sots. You're a heart so dead tomato splotched with moldy purple spots, Mr. Grinch. You're a three-decker sauerkraut and toadstool sandwich with arsenic sauce. He slunk to the icebox, he took the Who's Feast, he took the Who Pudding, he took the Roast Beast. Then he stuffed all the food up the chimney with glee. Now, grin the Grinch, I will stuff up the tree. <laughs> Up the side of Mount Crumpet, he rode with his load to the tip-top to dump it. Poo-poo to the Who's, he was grinchily humming. They're finding out now that no Christmas is coming. They're just waking up. I know just what they'll do. Their mouths will hang open a minute or two. Then the Who's down in Whoville will all cry, Boo-hoo. That's a noise, grinned the Grinch, that I simply must hear. He paused, and the Grinch put a hand to his ear. And he did hear a sound rising over the snow. And they'll sing, and they'll sing, 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 sing. And what happened then? Well, in Whoville, they say, that the Grinch's small heart grew three sizes that day. And then, the true meaning of Christmas came through, and the Grinch found the strength of ten Grinches, plus two. And now that his heart didn't feel quite so tight, he whizzed with his load through the bright morning light. With a smile in his soul, he descended Mount Crumpet, cheerily blowing hoo-hoo on his trumpet. He rode into Whoville, he brought back their toys, he brought back their floof to the Who girls and boys. He brought back their snoof and their tringlers and fuzzles, brought back their pantukas, their dafflers and wuzzles. He brought everything back, all the food for the feast. And he, he himself, the Grinch, carved the roast beast. Welcome, Christmas. Bring your cheer. Cheer to all who's far and near. Christmas Day is in our grasp, so long as we have hands to clasp. Christmas Day will always be just as long as we have we. Welcome Christmas while we stand, heart to heart and hand in hand. Wow.
Wow, that was a really great video. Oh yeah, I really liked it. Yeah, I enjoyed it too. Well, viewers, if someone sneaks in your house on Christmas Eve and destroys your Christmas tree, steals all your stuff, and takes all your food, they'll probably be back in a couple hours. <laughs> yeah. So, we thank you so much for watching this video. Please like or subscribe, and uh, let us mainly know. Mainly subscribe. What? Mainly subscribe. Yeah, mainly yeah. subscribe. If you have any other ideas on uh, future Christmas spoofs we could do or songs, let, please let us know in the comments below. Thanks for watching. Or best parody. Yeah, that works too. All right. Bye. Merry Christmas. Merry Christmas.